चुनाव आयोग ने लोकसभा चुनाव को घोषणा कर साथ दाजीलिंग जिला प्रशासन ने आपू इस पूर्ण रूप से तैयार रहे सन्देश दिया जिस अनुसार दाजीलिंग संसदीय आसन को लगी होने मतदान को निम्ति आगामी अट्ठाइस मार्च देखि नामांकन पेश कर सकने नामांकन पेश करने अंतिम मिति चार अप्रैल निर्धारित कर दाजीलिंग लोकसभा आसन में इस पाली सत्रह लाख तिरपन हजार छ सौ निनाबे जना मतदाता रहे जानकारी कराद दाजीलिंग की जिलापाल डाक्टर प्रीति गोयल ने इस संसदीय क्षेत्र में इस पाली बयालीस जना थर्ड जेन्डर मतदाता रहे एक हजार नौ सौ निनाबे वटा मतदान केन्द्र में छब्बीस अप्रैल को दिन मतदान होने भे जिस को मतगणना चार जून को दिन होने निश्चित इसबारे दाजीलिंग की जिलापाल डाक्टर गोयल ने एक पत्रकार सम्मेलन को आयोजना करी विस्तृत जानकारी कराए Thank you for all the cooperation you have extended to the district in all the other works, and uh, so this press meet is in connection with the Lok Sabha elections 2024. As we all know that Honorable E C I has announced elections yesterday, and the fourth Darjeeling P C is going for elections on in second phase. The poll day has been decided on 26th April, and we will be doing gazette notification on 28th March 2024. On the same day, we will start receiving the nominations, and the last date of making nominations is fourth April two thousand twenty-four. We will be doing scrutiny on fifth scrutiny of those nomination papers on fifth April two thousand twenty-four. Last date for withdrawal of candidates is eighth April two thousand twenty-four. Date of poll, as I said, is on twenty-sixth April two thousand twenty-four. Date of counting is fourth June two thousand twenty-four, and the entire election process has to be completed before sixth June two thousand twenty-four. So Darjeeling PC has seven assembly constituencies. Five of them fall in Darjeeling district. One of them fall in Uttar Dinajpur district, that is Chopra, and one fall under Kalimpong district, that is Kalimpong AC. So we have seven AROs, and uh, SDO Sadar, SDO Karshiang, SDO Siliguri, and four more AROs who are who will be looking after this the selection process. In that for Darjeeling PC, we have total number of electors as seventeen lakhs fifty three thousand six ninety nine, out of which eighty seven thousand eight lakhs seventy eight thousand one forty eight are male electors. Eight lakhs seventy five thousand five zero nine are female electors, and forty two are third gender. We have one nine 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 nineteen hundred ninety nine polling stations in for Darjeeling PC. 410 are urban 1589 are rural polling stations and uh, <clears throat> work of continuous updation is going on and we have few absentee voters who will be voting through postal ballot we have pwd electors 13326 13326 pwd electors in darjeeling pc 10629 as 85 plus electors in darjeeling pc Eleven thousand one eighty-seven as service voters. So the first two categories, PWD electors and eighty-five plus electors, they will be given an option. We will be giving them a form, twelve D form, where they will express their willingness whether they want to come to polling stations to vote, or whether they want to vote through postal ballot staying at their home. So they will be given that option. So those who want to come and visit the polling stations, if they have any locomotor disability, we will be arranging wheelchairs for them. And if they wish to vote, vote through postal ballot, then that facility will also be provided to them. And regarding ser service voters, we will be issuing them electronically transmitted postal ballots on the day of the uh, when the candidates are finalized. So regarding DCRC venues for 22nd Kalimpong AC, the DC venue is Scottish University's Mission Institute Kalimpong, and that is that is the RC venue and counting venue is also the same. For twenty third Darjeeling AC, Darjeeling Government College is the DC venue. RC venue is again Darjeeling Government College, and counting venue is the again the Darjeeling Government College. For twenty fourth Karshang AC, we will be doing DC RC at Saint Alphonsus High School, but counting will be done here in Darjeeling. Regarding twenty fifth Matigara, twenty sixth Siliguri AC, and twenty seventh Fancy Deva AC, the entire process DC RC and counting will be done in Siliguri College, Siliguri. For Chopra AC is Islampur College in Islampur is the DCRC venue and counting for the counting the machines will be brought to Siliguri College and the counting will be done there. 
regarding we have formed teams for mcc for c vigil for expenditure monitoring we have formed fsts we have formed v, uh, ssts we have formed video surveillance teams we have formed accounting teams which are necessary for uh, uh, expenditure. expenditure monitoring so for mcc we have 152 teams for c vigil we have 139 teams <clears throat> for fst we have 57 teams sst we have 65 teams vst we have 46 teams then we have 40 nakas in the entire darjeeling port uh, uh, darjeeling pc we have complaint helpline numbers also in district headquarter karshom and siliguri and there is 1950 toll free number which will be working round the clock in this district headquarter and also take help of national grievance portal c vigil app to file any complaints if they have so uh, among the polling stations we have three polling stations where p minus 2 day movement will be happening those are in darjeeling pool bazar blocks the polling parties will be moving there on 24th the other polling stations the pol polling parties will be moving on 25th but for these polling stations they will be moving on 24th we have start already started conducting the training of the uh, officers involved in the election process we have already trained our sector magistrates fst teams vst teams etc so uh, recent uh, soon we will be training our polling personnel also first training we will be having on 23rd and 24th then we will be having a hands on training for presiding officers and p1 officers and then the second training most probably will be having on 13th and 14th as the dates are uh, clear we will be notifying that <clears throat> and sweep activity has been going on in swing in the district and we are hoping that voter turnout will be better than the last elections our con communication plan is ready integrated control room will be set up in this district where the suvidha where ngs everything will be running from that integrated control room voter information slips will be distributed to all the voters 5 days prior to the poll day but voter information slip is not a document which is recognized for voting can it has uh, voter has to carry their voter cards to the uh, to the polling station other than voter card there are other 12 documents which can be taken up for voting which can be uh, those are aadhar card mgn rgs card passbook pan card driving license indian passport pension document unique there are such 12 such documents and uh, regarding the we we as of now we don't have any polling station which has electoral number more than 1500 so we are uh, Uh, in Darjeeling district, but there is one auxiliary polling station in 22 Kalimpong AC and six auxiliary polling stations in 28 Chopra AC. So all the polling stations will be provided with assured minimum facilities like toilets, ramps, lighting, etc. And as you know, the nomination will start from 28th and will continue till 4th. Candidates are required to publish their criminal antecedents thrice during the process. child labor is prohibited in this election no child will be engaged for any election related activity and it applications there are different it applications for example c vigil to file complaints sugam is there to requisition vehicles suvidha is there for rally permissions for vehicle permission etc voter turnout app is there encor is there and saksham app is there for persons with physical um, uh, with disability and so this is regarding uh, the our preparedness for the elections we are hoping that in darjeeling pc we will be having a peaceful election like we had in had in previous elections through your uh, this thing i would also like to communicate to the voters and to the candidates that there are that there are few sections which are related to uh, expenditure monitoring for example section 127a of the representation of people act 1951 which requires that if a candidate is publishing any pamphlet or any poster then the address of the printing press should be published there so that uh, so that we can know that from where the printing was done and that expenditure can be booked and again the distribution of money liquor etc to be avoided during the to be not to be avoided but should not be there at all during the elections and all the candidates who will be contesting the elections are required to submit the accounts of the elections how much expenditure they have done and uh, uh, the registers will be maintained for that shadow shadow register and all so the mcc will be <coughs> monitored from this office suvidha will be monitored from this office and that's all from my side 
Uh, any sensitive booth? Uh, sensitive booth as we are a border district, so we have declared some sensitive booths on the basis of uh, last year's last elections voter turnout and the border areas. Criticality assessment. Uh -huh. Ashwana, we have asked How all many the uh, 158 potential. 158 polling stations. Potential. Potential polling stations. Now, highest polling stations are what? Highest. Polling station 158 total polling stations. Highest is not be. So we have total based on the previous elections data that there are some criteria given by election commission. For example, if the voter turnout in the last election was more than 95% and out of that 75% votes were polled to one candidate, on those criteria we assess the criticality. Uh, the votes are, uh, we have received seven CAPF companies. And uh, like election commission has an uh, announcement that the uh, civic volunteer will be not engaged. We are not in engaging them. them. Yes. Can you give me how many uh, equipment to put? Three. How many voters there? How many voters there in P minus three? Around three thousand five hundred. Three thousand five hundred. Three thousand five hundred. P minus two polling booths are in Darjeeling Pool Bazaar. Uh, Daragaon Junior High School, one is Ramam Forest Primary School, one is Samanden Forest Primary School. Polling station number 23 by 2, polling station number 23 by 3, polling station 23 by 4. Live large, pay less. Ottawa, come dama, did it to be that. Zim Kana, looked up yoga deck, baby pool, for a kilo garden, nani harulai kilne town, community hall, terrace garden, ani mandir lagayat ka suvida haru. April the hazard job is vitrama, sorna, sokmu hune sa. Two ani three BHK flat haru. Dwarka Prime Vega Circle Nazik Sampark Gornhus 9733399970